This is a dynamometer I'm building to measure the torque output of one of my wind turbines. I'm interested in finding out how much torque in um, foot-pounds the shaft is able to put out. This is a familiar design to most of you that build wind turbines. The uh, permanent magnet alternator with a stator. The only difference on this application is I've affixed it to a pivoting shaft. And on the shaft is a torque arm. And at the end of the torque arm, at exactly 12 inches out, there is a digital scale which is going to measure the uh, applied force as we start putting the uh, load to that stator. <clears throat> There's your bridge rectifiers. Rectifies a 12 volt DC. And we're going to use a carbon pile to apply the heavy load to this uh, stator. <clears throat> There's some more uh, functions that I'm still building to it, but for now, in this demonstration, we're just going to use a 12 volt drill just to apply a load just to uh, see how the RPM drops and compare it to the force on the scale. And by those two calculations, we're going to calculate the uh, horsepower. So in kilowatts torque in foot pounds times RPM divided by 9,549 is going to give us our kilowatts. Um, the same formula for horsepower is torque times foot pounds times RPM divided by 5252. So uh, shortly I'm going to do a brief demonstration here. And it's just going to be a quick demonstration of what we're doing <clears throat> and actually how accurate it is. Okay, so we're going to start this machine up and we're going to put a load on this. I'm going to zero the scale to start with. Fairly accurate reading. And we're going to start the electric horse uh, motor. Thirty-seven RPM, uh, one point six pounds of torque. That's about seventy-three watts of power that that drill was using when it was uh, running no load. We loaded that machine down to two hundred twenty-six RPM. We were measuring nineteen foot-pounds of torque, which calculates out to four hundred and forty-nine watts of.